You do something that's very interesting that a lot of people do that I'd like to spend really a, a decent amount of time talking through, and that's the seminar model. Mm -hmm. So would you mind just, I know you just went through one this week, right? I did. I, okay. did, I did two seminars yesterday here in Springfield. Okay. And so walk me through, okay, so your marketing budget is, is how much for the week? Uh, so anytime we do a market, we do a uh, uh, Medicare seminars, marketing budget is always $5,000. Okay. And uh, that includes putting, you know, attendance, getting people there. Yep. And, uh, and that also includes the food. Okay. Uh, and, uh, and so that, and that we typically get four seminars out of that tip, three to four seminars out of that budget, depending on where we're doing them at. And, and if it's like in St. Louis, it's typically three, uh, Springfield, you know, we're going to get four out of that budget because okay. we're going to do two in Springfield, one at Springfield North, one at Springfield South, one in Branson, one in Joplin. Okay. If we're doing them in Kansas City, uh, we're typically getting three. Okay. Uh, and so we're mailing them because we always give the person, like yesterday in Springfield, we did one at uh, one thirty. And we did one at 5.30, just in case people were working at 1.30 yep. and they could attend yep. the 5.30 one. Yep. Yep. And, uh, and that's two, uh, and that was yesterday. And then your yep. next two are going to be when? Uh, we have uh, one next week in Branson. Okay. And uh, we did last one, one last week in Joplin. What time is that? What time are those? I'm just curious. Uh, the one, uh, the the dinner ones always work better. So we try to do uh, 5:30 or 6 p.m. Okay. Uh, each time, and uh, the, the they always have a better attendance than the lunch ones. Okay. Uh, just because people are working, you know, the the seniors in today's world, you know, the, their full retirement age is 66, and some of them is you know 60, you know, it's in the 66 year old, uh, and so you know we're talk we're trying to uh, for Social Security benefits. So a lot of people are waiting till they're 66 to retire retire now okay but they're still going to medicare at 65 which means they're, if they're waiting to retire at 66 then that means they're still working and so that's why the dinner seminars always work better for us and uh, so we try to focus heavily on the dinner seminars i uh, we have a, a new rep uh new agent down in uh, jackson mississippi that wanted to get into medicare seminars i went down there last week and i did uh two events with him to i did his first two for him and uh and then he's doing he did the last two uh, last week by himself, you know, he, but he, uh, he learned from watching. What was me. the attendance? <laughs> the, it was great. Uh, the one in, uh, we did one in Horn Lake, Mississippi, and there was 69 people there. Okay. 69 individuals there. And, uh, and then we did one in Jackson, Mississippi, and there were 40, 47 or ballpark, ballpark okay. and, and 40 something people there. Okay. And, uh, and it was really great. He got between the two seminars. He and we give out a little survey at the end, saying yes, please contact me, or no, don't contact me. And if they if they mark no, we take them off our list. Yeah. we're not here to chase people. We're not here yeah. to. Yeah. We want to help the people that want to be helped. Yeah, that's the people we want to visit with and sit down with. Yeah. I'm not in the I'm not in the business of, you know, begging people to meet with me or yeah. or chase them. Uh, yeah. there's too many other people that are looking for great help, and there's no reason to waste time on you know I agree. what I call China eggs. And, uh, and so anyway, so, uh, but he got over a hundred yeses and this is a brand new agent. His first week with us, got over a hundred yeses. So he's got over a hundred prospects. He called me this morning and he's already sold six plans this week already. And, uh, good for him. I remember, so I remember meeting with him. I remember ecstatic. meeting with him. What was that? Two months ago. And yeah. he was considering everything. He was sitting across the table from us no. and he was sitting there just scoping it out. Should I do it? And then he came to 8%. Yeah. And I had a couple of drinks with him at the bar. And he's like, I'm thinking about doing joining Brian. I'm like, dude, there's no smarter guy than to jump on his team. I'm like, yeah. and then here we are, what, a month after 8%, five weeks. And he's got his first, you know, it's just awesome, man. Yeah. And then, and then I went to Tulsa, Oklahoma the week before last. And I did uh, uh, two seminars for a new, a new uh, we brought on an agency there in Tulsa. And this is an agency that's very, very, very successful. They do a ton of uh, life and annuity business. Okay. And, and I mean, they're very, very, that's very. That's the guys I know, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're very successful, but they just never have implemented uh, Medicare into their business model yet. Yeah. And uh, so and they've got, they've got about 10 new agents. And I say 10 new, 10 just been there for, you know, a couple years or less. And these agents, you know, they were kind of having a retention problem. A, a, a small retention, not a huge one, but a small retention problem. And, and so, uh, they called me and, you know, they've heard about Medicare, et cetera. And, and, uh, so we talked and I went up there and did some Medicare seminars with them and two in, in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and they fall in love with it now.